Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at Integra Coach's top of the line Class A gas motorhome. This motorhome is perfect for couples and it gives you bath and a half. This is the 2023 Integra Coach emblem, model 36U. We are gonna be taking a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about the emblem and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. Again today, I am super excited to be showing you one of my favorite brands of motorhomes, the Integra Coach Emblem. Integra Coach is top of the line for a Class A gas motorhome. Before I begin, gotta say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea! Hi everybody! How's it going? It's going good, you guys. I am super excited. It is show season. Yes! It's 2023. Yes! New year, new start, new RV. Yes, we can't wait to see everybody this year at the Tampa RV Super Show. Andrea, also, I'll be at a whole bunch of different RV shows that General RV attends nationwide now here's what i will say if you see a particular model if we're not representing them at the, that particular show always remember to fill out your mat cash and we can sell it to you anywhere nationwide it's just certain shows have certain rules and so i can't quote you for an example on this unit at the tampa show but i can quote you at this unit at the ocala show but if you always reach out to my team i can quote it to you anywhere anytime any place we gotta follow show rules this year, you know what I'm saying? That's right. Andrea, can't wait to see everybody at the show, but more importantly, I can't wait to show everybody this motorhome. Let's begin. Model is Integra Coach Emblem 36U. The actual tip to tip length of this motorhome is 38 feet, two inches. This is Integra. I love it. Look at this, look at this. That is what Integra is. It's big, it's bad. It doesn't matter if it's their cheapest gas or their high send diesel. You know an Integra coach when you're driving down the road. Something else that Integra does is the big 120 inch windshield wrap around panoramic view with the glass front windshield. Looks freaking fantastic. Andrea, this is a 2023. So that means it does have the 7.3 liter V8. It is the Godzilla engine. Very nice. I keep wanting to say 350 horsepower, but it's not anymore. I believe it's 335 horsepower. Ford changed it all up on us. And so I'm just saying the 7.3 liter V8 because I don't know what Ford's doing. Right here, Andrea, we do have chrome mirrors on both sides with cameras integrated into the side. And then look at these tires, Andrea, the Michelins. I love those. 255-80R22.5 with shiny Alcoa rims. And then take a step back, another step. Another step, another step. Andrea, is that not beautiful? It is beautiful. It is absolutely, it's one of the best paint jobs in the entire industry. And you can see the new pattern scheme for 2023. I think they did a fantastic Good job. awning too. Yes, very nice power awning with LED lights. Frameless windows. And because this is Integra, they do have the two year warranty, three year structural warranty. Also, because this is the emblem, it does have the Easy Drive Elite, which is a computer balanced drive shaft system with Kony shocks. All of this stuff with the bigger chassis, it's gonna make it so it's one of the best driving Class A gas motorhomes on the market today. Coming on down. Looks look like at, a big TV. Heck yeah. Uh oh. My thumb's not strong enough. Or maybe it's still locked. Andre, huge TV right there. Very awesome. And then check oh. out this storage. Lovely carpet. It's carpeted still, Andrea. Wow. All right. They didn't unlock that one either. But look, you can see the storage all the way through. And Andrea, you know, it's a pro and a con. Check this out. Come over here. All the storage is connecting through, but it does have the carpet on the inside. All right. Coming on down. You did mention the awesome awning right here is your propane tank and then if miss jen bing please insert all the specs about this motorhome right here all right right here we do have storage very nice and then a little bit more storage right there and then coming around the back andrea we do have a 5,000 pound hitch 
This motorhome can tow 5,000 pounds. Backup camera right there. Really nice fiberglass rear cap and Andrea. There is a ladder to get up on the one-piece fiberglass roof. What? Did you talk about the hitch? Yes, 5,000 pounds. Oh, hitch. I'm sorry. No, I totally missed good. it. There is a ladder to get up on the one-piece fiberglass roof. Andrea, let's go up there and take a look. Okay, hold on. Here we go. Up here on the roof, you can see this is a very nice one-piece fiberglass roof. Not one, but two air conditioning units. I love that. Right there's a little Wi-Fi Ranger. Guard digital antenna. And you can see that it does have a solar panel already on the roof. Two steps. Last step. Great. And if you haven't already, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. What are the RV salesmen taking this fat ass up on the roof? Showing you what features the roof has to offer. Nobody. Nobody. Andrea, finishing up, 10 gallon water heater. Look, they kept it all black. Right over here, Andrea, we do have a 50 amp power cord right there with a place for you to run it through. We will touch on this motorhome uh, power cord a little bit later. And then check out this wet bay. Beautiful, look Good, at that. simple wet bay. Outdoor shower, uh, macerator, gravity dump. Very, very nice. There's even, even a paper towel holder and a black tank flush. And your potable water was there. Potable. Potable. Yes, ma'am. Right here is where we fill up our fuel. Okay. And then right here is our Onan 5500 gasoline generator. Other side of the storage. Yes, ma'am. And you can see how it all connects like that. Very, very nice. Yeah. And very then we got nice. our inverter there. Yeah. 2000 watt and our battery bank that is on a Moride slide out tray. Yep, and it just nice. makes it easier to access the batteries, which is very nice. Well, Andrea, the outside of the emblem is beautiful, but the inside looks even better. Let's go take a look. Be careful. Here we go now. Cargo carrying capacity 3,850 pounds. That's a lot. Yes, ma'am. Okay, I'm gonna come up here to the cab first. Then I'm gonna do a turn here and look at this. I yes. love it. I, I love this floor plan. Has such a good walkway. Plenty of space even with the slide in. And then here is the bathroom. And then the master bedroom, which you can still use the bed with the slide in. Yes. And Andrea, while we're getting the slide outs out, Let's give the big sponsor, let's give a big shout out to the sponsor of this episode. This episode is sponsored by RV Life Pro. RV Life Trip Wizards allows you to carefully plan your RV trip before you go. It will show you every campground along the route and let you plan important aspects of your trip like fuel, rest stops, break areas, and more. Know before you go with satellite views, street views, elevation, and grade charts. Then use the RV Life app to navigate your dream trip exactly the way you planned it. We are doing a free 7-day trial and 25% off with promo code MATSRVREVIEWS, no spaces. Thank you so much to RV Life for sponsoring us. Let's continue the video. Andrea, as you can see, it looks absolutely fantastic with a slide house out, a big, simple floor plan. That's so practical, that's why it's the best selling in so many different units. So first and foremost, I'm in the driver's seat. Power driver's seat, very nice. Right over here, I'm a commander. We got our cup holders here. EQ system, auto leveling, light control shades. Here's where you're able to adjust the mirrors. You have your light controls there. Very nice steering wheel. Andrea, this drives so nice. Right up there, we do have the... Um, place for you to put your phones bluetooth right here apple carplay android auto you're able to see your cameras and you have cup holders there andrea how do you feel i love it i feel comfortable i have a workstation yes uh, electrical outlets oh. cup holder we have a place for our phone and then is that also usb right by that power outlet there it is very very nice we have some storage above yes we have storage here Okay, very and nice. And over on the other side as well. Yes, I believe we have it there. And then, yep, nothing there. Both seats do swivel. There is a pedestal table that would go there. Yes, ma'am. And then we do have a bunk over the cab. 
Andre, do you know how much this holds? 750 pounds. Yes, ma'am. It does have a ladder. Yes. And as you can see, we have these uh, wooden slats here, which make it a little bit more comfortable, I yep. think. And that was that pedestal table right there. And then this bed, it can't come all the way down. The seats need to be swiveled for it to come all the way down or you'll scratch the uh, side of the sofa there. Is that a little bit of storage up above there? Yes, let's see. Oh. All right. Got storage there. We have our control panel here, which you can open the slides and check your tanks and all that stuff, lights. Yes, that's the Firefly system. It's actually very nice. So Andrea, look at this dinette. Look how low it oh, looks. Oh wow, that is really low. Yes, nice windows, no storage above. But we do have these valances. Approved, ding! Oh, Andrea loves those valances. And then it does have the daytime shades and the privacy shades. Slow rise, very, very nice. And then Andrea, I am digging the smaller dinette. Uh, it's very nice for me. I don't like sitting up too tall. I will say if you're taller, you might have an issue with it, but I have no problem with it. Solid surface on the table here. It does drop down to make a bed. And you have your cup holders right there. And then is that car seat tether behind there? Yes. That's a car seat tether. Cute little um, light sconce over there on the wall. And let's see if we got storage. Yes, we do. We sure do. And we have the piano hinges. Good Thanks, job, Mr. Walters, for adding the piano hinges. Guys. If you have any recommendations for Integra, comment down below. We recommend that they add piano hinges to access that storage better. They listened. You wanted it, they did it. So if there's anything else, just let us know. In Integra, the comments below. Integra will implement it if it's a great idea. And then coming on down here, we have four storages above. Cute LED lights above there. Yes, ma'am. Okay, good storage. And all four of them do connect. And then below that, we have the windows. And then we have these very nice tri cushion theater seats. Oh. Bum, bum. Andrea, oh my gosh. Could you imagine just having one of these chilling like this? Is it weird because it doesn't have a headrest or is it comfortable? No, no, it's still nice. It's totally fine because we did say that in another one, but this one totally works. I mean, yeah, let me, let me try it again. I know how people, yeah. Cause you see, you see how, yes. the, yeah, the other one was like in my spine. Too short. Yeah. Right. No, this one's perfect. We have another right here. This one doesn't recline, but that one at the end does recline. And this actually, oh, oh yeah. nice. Cup holders here, USBs, so I could be tick tocking, charging my phone, and then watching television. And directly across, Andrea, is the entertainment center. Okay? Storage above. Very nice. Good TV. Insignia. Soundbar. Don't know the name. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Insignia. Nice uh, Moroccan backsplash. Morocco. That's what I call it because it looks like it. And we've got Damn. a little bit more storage in there. Very nice. And a, an awesome Furion fireplace there. What's nice about that fireplace, Andrea, it does produce heat from electricity. Well, Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's now time for, for the, the MSRP. 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 On this unit here is two hundred and forty three thousand nine hundred and ninety eight dollars Andrea MSRP sale price we have it discounted I don't know the percentage but it's discounted to one eighty nine nine ninety five wow. Andrea that is a phenomenal price but Andrea, we sell, we are trying to be, I am trying to make general, the number one Integra Coach gas dealership in the entire country. So I know we can get you an even better price than that. If you're interested in this Integra or any Integra, please go to generalrv.com slash matscash, fill out the contact form. A member of my team nationwide will reach out to you and get you guys the absolute best price in America. To get to that form, we've linked it down in the YouTube description below. We've linked it on mattsrvreviews.com or we've given you a phone number, 844-969-4033.
You contact that form, we contact you, and you're driving home in a brand new Integra coach. Andrea, show us this kitchen. Okay. Uh, over here, guys, we have a nice little kitchen here with the cabinet above the sink. Okay. Okay. Uh, I like the window there, nice window, and I know this opens up. Yes, right it does. Spices in there. Yeah. Beautiful solid surface countertop. I love it. We've got a residential style sink Beautiful. with the extension. Yes, ma'am. And then underneath we have, ooh, good space for a trash can. Very nice. Over here we have, oh, a place oh. for sponges. Uh-oh. It just needs to be hooked back in. We've got a drawer here. There it is. <laughs> and then another drawer here. Yes, ma'am. And then above the convection microwave, we have some more storage. Very nice. Nice Virion convection microwave. Yes, ma'am. Two burner induction cooktop. Yes. Virion. Another one of these little spice racks. For your sugar and spices. And then over here, we've got another cabinet. Another one. And three more drawers. Let's see. Okay, that's the same size. This one's bigger. And then we've got the Whirlpool Residential Refrigerator. I love it. Ice maker, water purifier. Yes. Look how big this is. Let's get a full look at that. That is freaking awesome. All I love right. that. Okay, what's over here? You know it. Let's see. Okay, so this is the pantry. Oh, yeah. Very nice. I was beginning to think there wasn't one. And then over here, let's see, we've got more storage. Yes, ma'am. And then under here, hmm, it's vented. That means it must be prepped for a combo washer and dryer. Yes, ma'am. So if you want the storage, you can have it. But if you want a combo washer dryer, you can have that That's as well. That's right. And yes. then going into the bathroom, let me show this real quick before you go in there because it's so beautiful. Wow. I love the vanity lights and it's very cute. Yes, show us this medicine cabinet. Okay, so really pretty. I love the white in here. Yes. I love this backsplash that they're doing. Cute oh, yeah. sink, storage under here. Yes. And then you got some more storage right here for wow. linens. Wow. Yes. Wow. I'm impressed. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Well, let's see if I'm gonna be impressed with the... Um... The toilet? Yeah, there's no backsplash there. I would have liked to see this in the backsplash in the kitchen. I don't know if it would have looked as good because of the white in here. Uh-oh. There's no uh-ohs. Andrea, people were giving me crap about the Accolade I know. 37K. And this is the same layout. It's the same layout, yeah. just as a Class A gas. And guess what, America? Guess what, America? This is also a prime pooping position. Bing! Everybody was all like, Matt, it's a half bath. It shouldn't get a prime pooping position. Actually, look at Am this I touching? No, Am I touching? No, I'm going to do a, a shot from up here. You're really not. It's pretty spacey for a half bath. <laughs> all right. <laughs> yeah. Andrea. It's Matt's review reviews, and I don't lie. Even for Integra, I don't lie. Okay. okay, going into the master bedroom, we have a pocket door here. Yes, ma'am. Wardrobe. We got the TV on, which is kind of cool. Right here. Good size. Yes, ma'am. Lots of drawers, I see. Wow. We've got six drawers down here. Yes. Little, but doable. You call that little. That's normal for everybody else. <laughs> All right. And then we've got the other wardrobe. Oh, storage, storage behind here. Yes, ma'am. Wardrobe. Huge. Huge. I call it. I call it huge wardrobe. Very nice. And then we've got a nice king size bed here with yes. uh, three storage cabinets above. And we've got the opposing windows. Cute yeah. uh, headboard. And there is a power outlet inside there, and which I is good. I see that under there. For yeah. The CPAP. Yep. Wireless phone charger. With storage down here. I yes. like that. On the other side as well. Yes. And do we have storage under the bed, I wonder? Yes, we do. We sure do. Okay. Bickety bockety boop. And then, Andrea, we have a nice pocket door. I forgot there was a bathroom in here. <laughs> All right. Okay, Very look at nice. that. Not a bad step up there into the shower. Whoa! 
This is a huge shower it on dry really dock. It really is. Look at Fan it. Fan freaking tastic. Look, that's crazy. I'm looking. I'm liking. It's very, very nice. Uh, here we go with the cute vanity lights again. Nice medicine cabinet. Wow. And again, once again, Andrea, I forgot the liquefy. Jen, bing. Please put our black tank treatment. If you guys want it, get it down in the link below. Available now on Amazon. Storage underneath. And then we've got more storage over here. Yes. Andrea, I mean, everybody's calling me a liar with these Integras. I think it's your turn. Oh, okay. Please. All right. Tap it. Of course. Porcelain. Okay. This is a prime pooping position. Bing! Oh! Even Andrea says prime pooping position in but these Matt, Integras. I want to see you sit there real quick. Dang, nab it. Sorry, I just, you know, got to see. Oh. See? I will, actually. For me it was, but... Maybe... If it was angled a little bit more. Guys, get your liquefied. Oh, it's not bad, but I don't know if it's passable for you. Mm. I swear to gosh, this is not because people gave me a hard time. I don't care. Guys, come here. Come here. I don't care if you give me a hard time. My word is my bond. And it's I'm not influencing this decision because of that. I'm only doing it because of my situation. And Andrea, I am rubbing. This is not a prime pooping position. Womp, 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 womp. So that negates my PPP. Unfortunately, it does. Yes. I can negate her PPPs. I cannot negate her valence selection, <laughs> just so everybody knows. That's his specialty, not mine. Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody leaves, it's time we give people three things we love about this motorhome, three things we just don't like about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Let's do three things we uh, like about it first. Really? No, you... I'm sorry. Three things we dislike about it first. Okay, because you did that last Integra. I did. And yeah. I always like ending Integra on positive note. Andrea, but we actually do have two dislikes on the outside. Andrea, dislike number one. We've said it last year. We said it the year before. And guess what? We're saying it this year. Dislike number one is going to be the carpet and the storage right there. Not a fan of that. Never have been a fan of that. Never will be a fan of it. Now, here's what I will say. It does help with the noise dampening because stuff isn't going to rattle around. But for me, I, I just think about getting moist stuff in there and then the water and stuff gets on the carpet. That is dislike number one. Andrea, what's dislike number two? Dislike number two, Matt, is going to be for me that the power cord is not on a reel. Yes. That makes it heavy. You got to pull it out. You got to put it back. Right. It would be nice. You know, especially for a top of the line yes. classic gas motor home, we want to see a 50 amp power cord reel. That's dislike number two. What's dislike number three? Okay, my third dislike, it's not a big deal. Okay. But it's hard for me to pick in here because it is a well designed floor plan, I will say. The kitchen is just a little bland back here. What do you I mean? mean? What I do you mean? I just feel like it needs something. Andrea, don't use the word bland with Integra, please. Please don't do that to I me. I feel like they could have put some backsplash or something in here. I can concur with that. Just yeah, like there's too much wood. There's too, too much, much wood. wood. Yes, it's like clunky. Yeah, clunky. Clunky. I like it. I like the word clunky. <laughs> don't use the word bland when it comes to Integra. Okay. That's three things we don't like about it, Andrea. Now it's time for three things. We love about this motorhome. Here's what I will say. Yes, it might not have a backsplash, but I love the window right here yes. in the kitchen. I love the solid surface countertop and I love the induction in a nice top of the line Class A gas motorhome. That's number one. Andrea, number two. Number two. What I really like about it is I love the sofa. Yes. I love the three seater sofa. Yes. It's a big deal to me having that. And it actually, you know, it's comfortable, it reclines. You got USBs, you can put that down. So nice. It's great. That's number two. And then Andrea, number three, I mean, I got to say the headlights because I love the headlights. But not only that, Andrea, what I'm going to say is how nice this motorhome is with the slide outs in and how you're able to access that bed with the slide outs in. You know what I'm saying? This is just a well thought out, well designed motorhome. You're still able to get to the half bath. It is a prime pooping position in there. And again, overall, again, this is a floor plane that every manufacturer makes. I just love the way Integra does it, and I love the residential fridge, and I just love it. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, America, remember, this is show season, and I might not be able to sell this to you at an RV show, but I can always sell it to you when you go to generalrv.com slash mattscash. 
fill out the contact form, call 844-969-4033, contact us any way you can, and I promise we will always get you guys the absolute best price in America, and you can always get to those forms from down in the description below and on mattsrvreviews.com. Andrea, what do you want to say? Hey, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Yes. And Tagra, they do read the comments. They do watch the videos. Yes. So leave your feedback. Guys, we're excited. We hope to see you at the Tampa RV Show. Yes. Show season. Show season. New year, new RV. Also, comment down below. If there's a RV show that General RV attends, near you comment down below and if we yes, get enough comments we might show up there i hope you guys are safe and well thanks for watching thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching and andrea we'll, we'll see, see you next time, time.